Camille, you are so kind and you are so generous. You always put others first and you always do your best to make them happy. so thankful to God that you're my sister. I know we're so opposites. We don't even look alike and people think that we're just best friends. But they're not wrong because we are. You are my best friend. This man has always been a leader and has truly really taken care of her since day one. I've witnessed it. And not just her, but every one of Cam's friends and loved ones. We're so thankful for your big heart, and I'm so happy Camille found forever in you, Martin. Martin, I love you with all my heart. On February 10, 2017, I met you for the very first time, and since then you have filled my life with joy and full of amazing memories I'll cherish forever you are my best friend my soulmate my sunset no matter how pale you are to me you are my own sunset for Camille as a wife be subject to Martin because he's the head of your family soon you'll have kids Honor him, respect him. He's the point man for the coming years as you build your family. And for Martin, love Camille in an understanding way. I know you'll fight, you'll get impatient, but uh, just continue to love her. And one last thing is don't stop being fascinated with each other. When you reach 20, 50 years of your marriage and like Noel and Anne, we're learning also from them. Don't stop being fascinated with one another when you wake up. Remember the day when you gave your vow to, to one another. When you guys got engaged, I asked Cams, how does she know Martin is the one? And Cam said that she feels safe and calm with you. And to her, you're home. Since we have met, you have done so much for me. I am a different man, a better man, a stronger man because of you. You opened my eyes and introduced me to new cultures and new experiences. You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. Now, before our family and friends, I vow for the rest of my life to love and cherish you, to protect you, to encourage you, and to grow old with you and our future family. To my mom and dad, thank you for guiding and looking up for me. And You've always nurtured and protected me and loved me. And, but I've seen that you've loved each other and every day when I was growing up, whether intentional or not, um, that love um, that you've shared, that I've seen, have a deeply profound impact on me. I know what real love is because of, of you too. Um, and I love you both with all my heart. As your wife, I vow to love you and cherish you until the end of time. I vow to put us first and make us sure we are constantly working to grow together. I vow to be there for you through all of the uncertainties and trials of life. Lastly, I vow to be your true companion always for one lifetime, which you could never be enough. Today, I become your wife and other half and I can wait 
to start our future trip together. 22nd of July, 2022. Let's welcome Mr. and Mrs. Hannigan. Congratulations. I can't uh, wait to spend my entire future with you and plan um, all the fun things that we will be doing in the future. I love you.